That's just threaded through. Sweetly timed. Not trying to overhit it, Phil Salt. Yeah, Ben Dors just, just trying to get it up there, see if there's any swing on offer. Phil Salt makes no mistake, climbing into that, timing it sweetly through the offside. Right out the screws. Oh. Beautiful boundary, a ball to go, and a fortunate one to follow up. Thickish inside edge. Played for Worcestershire in last year's vitality blasted Dorcius. Hit the pitch bowlers. And that's well played from Laurie Evans. Just used the pace of the ball, soft hands guiding it through the third region. Slower delivery and into space. Maybe telegraphed a little bit. He does bowl it well, does Tom Helm. Hit hard and hit far. Picked up cleanly. Just bouncing before the boundary edge, but yet another. Skied. Opportunity. Maybe the first breakthrough. And it is. Safe hands from Helm. One went agonisingly over his head. Yeah, Tom Helm making no mistake here after a half chance earlier. The difference quickly organising his feet. That's the value of the reverse sweep. Just by moving that fielder behind square, a regulation cut. Short uppercut beautifully. And will it go away for four? No, yes it does. That's twice now Helms tried to save the boundary and failed. Shoveled leg side into the hollies. Back of the hand, slower ball. Really good execution from Saul. 73. Straight up and straight into the hands, the very safe hands of Henry Brooks. And Benny Howe picks one up. And it kept it quiet, put them under pressure, and maybe that's it because he just had to do something a little different. Just not really getting hold of it in the end. Oh, <laughs> that's got away from the keeper as well. Just a little edge and away to the boundary for four. Oh, that is beautifully timed, my goodness. Just a little hint of the power of Tristan Stubbs. Mate, we'll come back to you later. Thanks very much, Chris. Oh, oh that's gone again. That is into the short boundary, but I think it would have been big enough on the other side as well. Into the hollies and put down. 50 for Salt. Just a little shimmy down from Full Salt in the last few deliveries. He's just struggled a little bit to find the timing. But he finds the timing on this occasion. Oh, he's had some good fortune. It's spun away. If you swing hard enough, it'll go somewhere. Straight up. That'll be another one. This one was the knuckleball. And it's Moinelli with the safe hands for the Phoenix. He has got so much in his armory. And on this occasion, a lot better. That uh, could well be gone, yep. Whatever's coming out of his hand is working the magic at the moment. It's Benny Howell's evening. Surface would work in Benny Howell's favour, those barriers. Oh, oh, go full and straight. <laughs> Great hiding of the ball outside off. Let's take a look. There goes the appeal. Keep an eye on Salt. Left hand side of the screen. It is hugely important. <laughs> that 
crowd has been smashed for four. Followed him outside the off stump, but Lamanby does really well. He goes with the shape and hits it over wide mid off for four. And so the scoop comes. Charles Dagnall mentioned it, how he hits it in unusually. Another scoop and again over fine leg. This is really good batting from Turner and Lamanby. Hit over mid off and just kicks on and skids on for four. If they try and sneak a single to him, he wants to throw the stumps down. Oh, I reckon that could go all the way. It has gone all the way. This is a wonderful little cameo, wonderful little partnership between these two. Almost taking himself off his feet. The connection was good. The pace of it. Yeah, the fall over sweep. Look at that. That must be a wide, surely. Wade hits. Wade hits. It's not a wide. It's going to go through. That'll be a run out. Really lift aside Manchester Originals. I think after. Go. Just out of reach. His heart would have been in his mouth for a second. Yeah, a little nervous smile there. But he's away. Gone. Yeah! Little reverse sweep and a hush around the ground at Edge Baston. As Manchester Originals strike early. Yeah! Trying the reverse. Not working out on this occasion. Wonderful timing. Talking about him being good form. Nice and easy off the mark. Yes. What a start this is! Manchester Originals have got rid of the dangerous Moen Ali. The bigger gaps on the leg side. I get that. He's turned things over. That's good from Smead. He's been watching the wickets fall. Now he gets an, an opportunity. Using the pace, clever. There is some risk in the shot, but it's clever. Pierces the gap. There's two fielders on that leg side boundary, and he still finds the gap. It's a bit short, too short to start, and too easy to put away. More than enough on it, and what a way to end those five deliveries. And what a way to end the power play. Picked up beautifully, that has gone a long, long way. And it was a roundabout leg stump, it said hit me, and he belted it for six, a long way back. What a brilliant piece of fielding. Could that be the end of Benjamin? He maybe thinks so. End of Benjamin. And how many times have we seen this? Wayne Madsen, who's excellent in the in ring. But how many times this hundred have we seen some lax running? You're not hitting the stumps. Well, he did, Chris. And you've got to go. A big, big moment in the game. A sloppy, soft run out. And Benjamin has to go. Slower delivery, screams of catch, it should be easy. And is. Mention about those changes in pace from Paul Walter. Well, one run himself out, and then Smead gets on strike and hacks it up in the air. Walter's change of pace, he will be tricky on this surface, I tell you. It's not. Classic shot. Very nice from Matthew Wade. Cut. Easy 
as you like. The change has done it. Parkinson's introduction means the demise of Matthew Wade. Originals all over the Phoenix here. Wade couldn't believe what he had done. He went down on his knees. I've just chipped it to cover. Excellent from Parkinson. The Phoenix have struggled with. Although the originals managed to get another breakthrough. This time, Dolavira, he's the man to fall. And Hartley has now got three. Comfortable for the big man, Walter, out in the deep. Sydney Sixers. Oh, yeah. But not today, straight through. Just as I was saying, he can hold a bat. He can hit a long ball. Straight through. And Hartley, again, in on the action. He's been so, so good. So Lemonby, Hartley, Turner, a good job. That's better. That's exactly what Phil Salt told him to do. Was hit one over the video screen. He said, stop messing about with the reverse sweeps and things and hit one over the video screen. A great pickup in the deep. Uh, wonderful fielding. Hey! Oh! Brilliant fielding. I think the long legs and long arms of Tom Hell might be okay, but we'll listen to David Milne. We saw him with the bat earlier, but just look how flat that throw is as well. Just skidded on straight into the gloves of. That's clearly short. I need to make my decision for the big screen. What a throw, pick up and the throw, Lydia, was just superb. Gone. They got one less again now, a little under edge. And Josh Little picks up his first. 12 runs away from having the lowest total, and this might be it, because that's another Skyer out to deep mid-wicket. Lemonby, you talked him up, you talked him up, and he did not disappoint. Comfortable catch out in the deep, and that is a very good win. Tom Lamaby with a safe pair of hands to get the last Phoenix wicket. It was in the air a long 